friends, welcome back to our friend the bucket, who we previously pulled a whole bunch of stuff out of. I'll put a link below if you want to know the history of this bucket ecosystem. And so it's a little bit later. I came back, was hoping to find a big bucket of Azola. Instead, I found a big bucket of seemingly nothing. Here are the Azolas, nearly dead. Look how they're all brown. Why are they not reproducing? I don't know. This, we all remember this stuff, right? Yeah. Does this even have a land, an above water component? By the way, when I touch this, this is warm. This is warm water. So we got a big net of this stuff. Planty, this planty stuff that lo it looks like a net with a bunch of little kind of like bubbles. You see those little bubbles? Then we have this mysterious item, which at first I thought this was connected to the net. And then I started tugging on it. And look at what this is. Will this focus? Yes. This is the tip of a grass where the top got heavy, leaned over, and it found water. And then all the little seeds in there started sprouting and are now happily growing in water. This guy. There was this guy. You've seen these. They get dry. So all the little seeds are clustered at the top. And then the top gets heavy once it has all these seeds, right? It's heavier than the rest of the stalk. So it dips down and sometimes it dips down into water and it all sprouts. And in fact, it happens so commonly, there's another one right there. I didn't even notice it when I first came out. Look at that. They're just growing right out of the plant. So beautiful. But the real question is, and then there's this, this little plant, there's a little flower there, and it's coming out, there's like a hole out here to the outside or a crack, and that's where the flower is. So this is, I think this is related to the, to the, this net grass. Not grass. Very interesting. Then there's like little little critters in there. Nothing too exciting. Why does this not want to grow Azola? I don't know. Maybe it needs some fuel in here. Maybe I should give it a little nitrogen or something. I'm not sure. I'll have to find out. But anyway, I thought you might be interested in this bucket update. Counterintuitive bucket update. Oh, look, there's little green stuff that grows around the roots of this thing. Ugh, it's so mysterious. I still don't know what this net is. Look, it grew into this other crack, too. So it seems to like growing into these cracks in the plastic. All right, enough of that. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.